What's up world, it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to get the OnePlus One CyanogenMod 11S lock screen on any Android device. Now if you're not familiar with the OnePlus One, it's a new flagship device from a brand new company. This company, which goes by the name of OnePlus, contracted CyanogenMod Incorporated to make the stock firmware for their flagship phone called the One. So far, supply has not been able to come anywhere close to demand for this phone, and only people with invitations can actually purchase it at this point. But you can enjoy the lock screen from this phone right now, no invite needed. You don't need to be rooted or anything like that, but you will need to have unknown sources enabled under Settings, Security. That's because this app is not on the Play Store, since developer Selchuk Urkel pulled it for some reason. But it works as advertised nonetheless, and there's still an APK out there floating in the ether. You can grab your copy of this installer file from the full tutorial, which can be found at the link in the description below. And once you've done that, simply tap the Download Complete notification to launch the installer. From here, just hit Install, then when that's finished, press Open. The app has a really basic interface, but that's okay. Simple is good. You just toggle the switch at the top to On, and your new lock screen will be in place. There's also an option to change the color of the lower half of the lock screen, and there are nine different colors for you to choose from in here. But with all that set up, one thing the app doesn't do is disable your existing lock screen. That's easy enough to do. Just head to Settings, then Security. From here, tap Screen Lock, then select None from the next menu. Now your old lock screen won't show up anymore, so let's see what the new one looks like. And when you're checking this out for the first time, be aware that Android doesn't allow lock screen replacement apps to show up until 5 seconds after you've locked your screen. But anyway, as you can see, the new lock screen looks and behaves exactly like the one from Cyanogen 11S. Pretty slick if you ask me. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.